Hi, welcome back to another game of Steel Division. Today I'm using the 20th Panzer Grenadiers going up against the 3 Wagov uh, Mechanese Corpus. And again, it's another live game. I uh, thought maybe going forward I'll try and see if the live games work or not. And just before jumping, I'll just quickly go over the two decks and then jump in. First up is the 20th Panzer Grenadier German Mechanized Battle Group on a Maverick Deployment Type. And you can just have a quick look over the units here. They've got a nice uh, set of infantry that you can bring up with the Stoss Group, Pioneers, and Panzer Grenadiers, along with the Storm Pioneers. And the Stug 4s, really good for helping with your infantry. I've also got the Panzer 5 4, you only get one of these and only one card. And it's a pretty unique unit to this deck. It actually looks quite cool. It's a nice paint on it. You've also got the Tiger Commander, which you can bring up, uh, which I decided to try out. The Elephants, very powerful tank destroyer. You can see with their 230 pen. And these aren't even APCR shells, it's just very powerful. Uh, the Arc Panzers, they've got a nice buff as well, which I've noticed. It's now 145 pen. I'm pretty sure these used to be 135. Also got the Flak Panzers and Flak Panthers, but uh, well, one of each. And I didn't get to use these because the AI, uh, what I've noticed is in a 1v1, the AI will rarely use the Air Force. They normally will save it till the end once they've run out of ground forces. And I was almost considering going to a harder difficulty, trying out very hard to see if that will change, if they'll then start using the Air Force. But I might try that out next video, um, or I might just um, have a few matches and see if it happens. If it doesn't, then I might just stick to the hard difficulty. If it does, then the next video you might see is against a very hard AI. So we've also got the off map, um, which is quite nice, and the heavy 150mm artillery, and then just some GU87s, BF109s. Next up is the 3 Wyakov Mechanese Corpus Russian Mechanized Battle Group on a Maverick Deployment type. And this is a pretty good deck if it's used correctly. Unfortunately, the AI doesn't seem to use it quite well, um, but it can still be a little bit of a challenge. The M chars, if used correctly with pushing with the infantry, they can they can mow down infantry. ZIS2 is really good at dealing with armor, and they've got a lot of nice planes that they can bring up. But as I mentioned earlier, the AI for some reason just doesn't choose to use them. Also, the off map you won't you won't really see this coming out. Whereas this would be uh, quite deadly if he if he did use it. Uh, but we'll jump into the game now. Okay, so we'll start. I already accidentally pressed start. Um, I should have waited until after the intro. Um, so the idea is that I'm going to try and push this town with the majority of my forces. To do that, I do need to set up some defences over on the left and right flank. Um, so that's where most of my uh, like my beginning income went into. So I've just got some Stoss Troop and Panzer Shrek forces along with some Pioneers at the back there. And they're just going to hide as far into the forest as they can get. I've got some Flame Wolfen. Uh, deploying there along with some Stoss Troop and I've also got a Flame Weapon over here and another Stoss Troop here and they're just going to hold onto that area uh, then back here I've got some more units I've got the Stoss Troop they're going to get as deep into the forest as they can and the Panzer Strike will just hide in the back there we've got some Panzer Grenadiers, MG42, another Panzer Shrek. Pack 40 and Recon, they're going to use this cliffside to kind of hit stuff moving along this road if it can reach, um, or anything trying to push along this field. In the center, I've just got some Panzer uh, Grenadiers along with the Panzer Fire 4, 
and I'm going to bring up some recon for them. I'm also going to bring up another tank on the right side with some more recon. that direction. I might keep this recon unit, sorry, uh, this recon is back here just until the tank arrives and I will need some infantry so I was thinking of some pioneers on either end and I can even bring up some panzer grenadiers and they're going to kind of sprinkle into these buildings here so that we can start to push forward so it's a very um, defensive position to begin with. Um, I just hold on to this flag somehow. Looks like we've got an M char moving across on the right side. Pioneers taking on an M char as well, which is not ideal. So I'm going to try to pull them back. Uh, looks like he can still see us. See if we can get that Panzer Shrek line. Uh, because they do have tanks moving along here, I should probably bring up my own Stug 4. Molotov's going down. Maybe I can hit by that flamethrower though. And as he does get down, so we should be able to maybe get the surrender there. Oh, another flame back there. Just to pull back. Might just bring in some air support. Let's keep trying to pull these guys back. I think we did hit now that they are here. Yeah. Oh, there we go. I actually didn't need this. Uh, so let's pull that back. So I'm going to send those pioneers across and unload them along with the rest of my forces drop some pioneers and I think we can bring the recon up as well, it should be safe I want to get vision of that road for our tank ok so the right flank does look like it's taken a bit of a hit I might even need to bring another stug up. And we'll try to get a couple of flame waffles into this forest. Oh, that stug does go down. Unfortunately, we didn't have vision of what hit us. So it looks like the enemy did decide to start pushing out on this right flank first. And lost our recon vehicle again. There's a frag grenade. Oh, the Panzer Grenadiers are getting hit by those tanks. I might need to bring in some artillery so I can bring up some smoke and just try to get these guys out of here. Oh, actually, 
There should be a cane that they're in the building. If I can get back into the building. Tank's about to engage. Shot off. We will try to bring up those pioneers to help against that Guardia squad. I think we just lack in vision there, so I might jump. Try to get that surrender. Well, that recon does need to get out of there. Oh, we've got an M Trover on the side there. So We'll move up these flame off into the forest and with this one to keep that flag secure and then we're going to push our stug into position and try to get a hit on there. Do you have some recon back here? Let's leave him there. Some more infantry moving along there. I might actually have to bring up my last flame often. And just in case they do get through the forest, we'll bring up some Panzer Grenadiers. So mortars ready to go. Uh, looks like we might need to T34 did get taken out by our Panzer Shrek, I believe. Another nice hit there. So we've got four shells left. I don't think this pack 40's been getting too much action. Let's look at a ZIS 2 back there. We might try to knock that out. And we do have some infantry out here. They're not too much of a threat right now though, so we'll Definitely need to focus on that. Doesn't look like there's any AA. Oh, here it is. Something sitting off. I think they're... Oh, I think because he's on the move. Okay, so we did manage to knock out that M-Shot, so we can bring down... Oh, we lost another recon unit. We might actually have to bring up some infantry, because my vehicles kept getting taken out. There we go. Pull that BF one and nine back. That's so looking pretty good. Um, we should now be able to focus on front. Um, what I did want to bring up was my commander tank, along with another stug, and we'll bring up some infantry as well. We'll try to push into these buildings here and then try to get this flag. I do need some armor on the right, uh, on the left side as well. Looks like the enemy is making a bit of a push. I might even have to pull those back. I don't want to lose those just yet. Looks like that M char is just kind of hiding back there, I might be able to get a hit off. Some smoke grenades, that shouldn't be a problem. Oh, they're hitting my recon. Do you know they're there though, so we might just go for a bombing run. Yeah, I'm sure it does get taken out. 
the JU eighty seven should get its payload off. There we go, that's it there. The pioneers are getting pinned down, I might try to drop some smoke. Dog's getting some hits there. I need more infantry, so we'll bring up some more Panzer Grenadiers. I might even bring up some off map. We can push this dog along. I'm going to try to cut them off on the right side there. Bring up some recon. M2 is getting pretty close to my pencil gun ideas. Let's see if we can get into some buildings. Those are all pinned down anyway. So those, since they are pinned down, we should be able to get out. Going to use them pretty safely. Um, we'll just drop some mortifier. So the tiger getting some hits off on that T34. Try to bring them up and see if we can get some surrenders. I also do want to bring up some infantry, maybe some pioneers back here. There's another recon unit. Maybe we can just here. And I'll need some armor on the left side. So bring a couple of stocks. I need to path those a little bit better. President Grenadiers are getting hit by that carrier. Oh, I've run out of smoke. We did lose that. Oh no, here it is. Here, sorry. <laughs> I was going to say we lost that star, but we should be able to get a side shot off on that M shot. Oh no, sorry. I think I just got hit by both sides there. Uh, I might try to bring up Oh we got a sniper team hitting us Ok so looks like they have pushed us out of this forest so we'll bring in some JU87 to deal with them. Might also bring up some of the heavy guns. I think that's a 
Get up there, Commander. A target should have no problem taking those out. Flank seems fine. I'm always going to bring up an elephant as well. This will definitely have the range to hit that. Oh, and I forgot the elephant again. That's okay. Shot down, we should be able to start moving up these Panzer Grenadiers. And we'll bring up that Tiger. That commander. Yeah. Not too sure why he had that there. But with that, we do capture this flag now. We can start to bring up some more reinforcements. On the right, we get some more Panzer Grenadiers. Start going down there. I think that was that Valentine that knocked me out. Oh, we've got some storm pioneers, so we can try to bring those into the forest now. Okay, the grenadiers are getting hit. We're going to have to bring up. Should be safe to bring up that tiger. Oh, no, it should be okay. I have left the party in this. Some more units coming in there. So our elephant farming is getting able to set up, so that should be able to start putting some pressure on this road. Might even be able to bring up some recon. We're going to try and take these buildings. I will move my stug up onto the road. Some supply trucks. 
and we can make a push over there on this side. Uh, we'll, we'll save that for now, we'll just focus over here, hit them with some mortars. Got pioneers getting hit there. But they're about to get backed up, so we should be fine. Might even bring the stuff over this way. I just realized I have some big guns back here. Let's knock out that sniper team. And whatever's in that building. Oh, we do lose our tank somehow. So bring up another couple of stogs. So we are going to push forward now. Now that the Pioneer is back to full, we can move him forward. Oh, we did forget our leader, unfortunately. Oh, there's Tinker Sneaky. Hidden a few of our guys there. Not bring up our supply truck. Okay, so I think I've done a pretty good job taking this. We do knock out that sniper team as well. Make sure our right flank's okay. sneak things up into this area. bring a couple more storm pioneers over here and they can just hide in there just to make sure that that flag stays secure although there's a recon unit shouldn't really be much of a problem uh, so we should be okay here uh, I have two more tanks coming up I'll bring them up and to the left side or even Now we can start focusing over here. So this time I will remember to bring up the off man. Oh, we can actually double off man. It's gonna be pretty crazy. Check that out. I'm just trying to sneak around. I do have some flat which I might bring up. Just so they can't do that again. As well as if they do decide to bring up some air. I 
don't really have any armor to bring up with. I think I lost my armor. Oh, we do have the tiger though, so we should be okay. But once this drops, we actually can start really pushing up now. And we'll just unload here and then push up into these buildings. I didn't really need this uh, leader since I've got my commander back here. So we bring up the tiger. that flag. Looks like that was all they had. There could be some units that are pinned down maybe still from the off map. They might actually keep him back. And these guys can just secure that side. This, we should be able to bring those guys up pretty easily, and then they can push up over into this town here. And bring up a stub to help them out. Over here, a uh, flame wolf and dealing with that Resvetka that we saw earlier. Emcha taken out by the stub four. supply truck up. Might just try to knock out that guard year squad as well. So we'll get some guys into here and then we'll make a push up to here next. Bring up some more infantry. Coming in. I think we might better just hit him with our Panzer Grenadier if he can't spot us. We might just back the tiger up just so that we've got more of a range. So, might even bring this dog up onto the left side. And I did want to bring up a, another mortar just to help with our. Um, we're actually out of. Shells with that one. So do we have this stuck back here? We can just bring him up. So we'll just hit these back buildings here. Yes. 
sneak him out now. He can pull this one out. So they're going to be pushing up into there once we've secured this left side. So we might just keep him and we'll use this dog for a push up here. Sonic over there. Do have a Z IS2 back there, so we probably want to try to get out of there. How do you lose that stog? on that with my I'm gonna try to bring my leader up see if I can get direct hits I think that ZIS2 should be pretty weakened because of that. Oh we do lose
we're just going to be selling in that flag before the time runs out. Good game. So you do want to get a mind victory. I think if we got that last flag, it would have been a major. But yeah, 3700 to 900. Thanks for watching.